Chippy. Uh, not John Mouse. Jones. Uh, um, I'm Mighty Mouse. Mighty Mouse, GSP, and Daniel Cormier. Daniel Cormier is just fat, but he's that good. The mm. Does it fucking matter? They just dog him. Probably keep Kirk and Beaver as well. But the vast majority wear on roids, you can tell. You can just tell by some of their physiques that they're on steroids. It's about like Chael Son, and you can tell he was fucking huge. Yeah. Brock Lesnar and Alistair Overeem especially. Obviously Brock Lesnar, Jesus Christ. Brock! It's very much of a difference if you play on hard. Uh, they just, they you just, just have less grip. Most, it just adds more spots to them. Oh really? It actually, it actually does drag out the fights long. That's probably gives you reason to actually play the game on hard. I thought it'd just be like because they're it all scripted fights. It adds like an fights. extra step to like a, a couple of them, where it's like you have to break their arm and like make them drop the weapon and stuff. I thought it'd just be like artificial difficulty where they just give you less grip or something. No, that'd be fucking so frustrating. Rock. Uh, should be. Wait, do you just respawn after the end credits? I think it just yeah, it just puts you in new game plus. Wanderer's cloak is so clean. That's such drip. It is drippy. Well, I look like a spastic somewhere and all like the special like items. Is this a unique sword? Oh, here's a unique sword. That's the sun sword, and then this is the. What? Sword. That's boss. They just do more damage. If there, uh, if there was normal enemies, it would probably be. The sun be one makes it so you can use a sunbeam indoors, so you don't have to like have the sun so you can find where you're going. Oh, that's cool. Kind of useless because you probably get it by the time you've already killed all the colossi. Yeah, and you know where all of them are, so it's kind of really pointless. Yeah. But then there's the queen sword, which just kills. The I sense this there. game is going to get another remake. Me too. I, I but I wouldn't mind it to be honest because it's. It's one of them age. games. Yeah, and it, it. Yeah, I was going to say it doesn't look as good as I remember. I remember like the trailer at E3 when they. It first... looks really cool when you go in the forests and all the lighting's cool, but that's fine. Yeah. It has got one of the best soundtracks though, as long as you don't change the soundtrack. This game had Breath of the Wild climbing before Breath of the Wild, that's kind of mad. No, Breath of the Wild took definite inspiration from this game, it's crazy. Do you have infinite stamina? Oh no, the bottom right. Oh wow, you have so much fucking stamina, what the fuck? It's because I've played the game twice on this account, yeah. I have no idea how you're supposed to do this. Is this even the right wall? It definitely is, but like, you gotta... Is it not up the ramp at the, at the top? Uh, you go up the door, the, the way they went in the credits, the door's locked, so you have to get around. I don't know how we're meant to latch on to. Oh, do you want to see something stupid, actually? Uh, before I look up how you get up there. Not up it. Cheats. No. Parachute. <laughs> what? <laughs> look at this. <laughs> What oh, the fuck? fuck? Oh, you went through the building, boss. Right, I'm gonna look at You lost like, you lost like, no health. I didn't see that, are those just like... <laughs> what? I didn't, that was, was that part of the original game? Is that part of the remaster? It's part of the original game, it's just, um, you gotta do the time attacks. I didn't really realise how much content... Damn, this time. game, uh, yeah, I didn't realise this game, I thought this was, this is like such a one and done game. In yeah. my eyes, but it, I didn't realise it had so much content. It's also just exploring these like lands is really fun. Like, it, it gives me like a feeling map. I don't get from games anymore. Like, just, it's just so mysterious. Yeah, it, it gives me like Breath of the Wild on my first playthrough kind of vibes. Yeah. Big, big and open. There's not enough just like games that are just big and open. Because this game's big like... and open for no reason. It doesn't have to be, but it just makes it better. Um, right, I'll look up a video on how you do this. I was going to say, I don't think. It's like it's wondering grey. Grey hands. Oh. It's because I've got the skin on that just makes him as careful. The Shadow Link. Are these fucking sure. masks? What the hell? He rotten. It's gone rotten. What do the masks do? They just, oh, they're just stat increases. Yeah, they just increase stats. The Cloak of Deception make you fucking visible. Yeah, it but actually it does make you visible. Shadow, so. What? That's cool. I'm and the Colossi it. not see you then? Uh. Yeah, if but if you like sunlight, all, all, all these fun. things would be cool if there were like normal enemies in the game. But there's literally just the bosses. It's just yeah. the boss gauntlet. You'd think they would have had some like small light enemies in between. Yeah. Maybe if they do a sequel. Make I don't even cool. think does does the does the last guard you know whatever even have normal enemies? I don't even think it has enemies or fights or anything. Does it's it? Just, just guiding be... around the colossus. Yeah. Puzzles, which I does couldn't it... think of anything worse. <laughs> it's a puzzle game, isn't it? 
Really bad controls and really bad AI. Mm -hmm. Ika! Big old Come dog on. thing. I remember the E3 trailer for that looks so fucking cool as well. How do you get to the bridge? Why are there so many how to get to the bridge things on YouTube? I just want Shadow of the Colossus. What other games do you have to get to a bridge on? Um, Giant Light 1. They were like Arkham Knight and GTA 5. <laughs> Did you want bridges in GTA 5? Can games make something unique? Because I'm sick of this. Space games. Yeah, we are we are in a vast lack of creativity in the it's gaming just, industry at the moment. Just the same shit over and over again. Me and Reese talking about this the other day though. It's like it's not as bad as the two thousands where they would make superhero films about comic book characters and then make adaptation game adaptations of those really bad films. So like the the Dark Knight had a game, oh, okay. the Green Lantern had a game. That is that is that's not the right way up, surely. Yeah, it's not the right hill. There's a bit I'm trying to get to, it's not the right bit anyway. Ninja Turtle movie game fucking they just get Hollywood films and make them into games. They don't really do that anymore. I'm bored those, right? Uh, the Revenge sure. of the Sith game. The Revenge of the Sith game is kind of baller. Uh. Yeah, this is the one. Yeah. I think that other one might lead to the garden, but I'm trying to get to the bridge. Bridge. It's out in it. What's the point? Can't get anywhere. Uh, it's achievement. <laughs> I like when Platinums are just like, experience everything the game has to offer. A lot of Platinum trophies are just kind of bullshit and they still don't make you do. Like, even the Arkham game trophy, Platinum doesn't make you do all the Riddler trophies, doesn't make you oh, like... Saying, this isn't even the right wall either. <laughs> Son of a bitch. You back in. Like, think of how much of the, the Fallout and like Bethesda game trophies don't make you do a lot of the cool shit. Go to level 50, do 100 Mystic yeah. trophies. Good, good platinums make let you experience the whole game, or yeah. all the best that has to offer. Yeah, this makes you do yeah. a full run of the game. Yeah. A few times. Do, do. Some Dark Souls trophies are just unnecessary, though. I, I don't want to collect ten thousand yeah. rings and every spell in the game and fucking every weapon. This is shit. I hate I hate collectible trophies more than anything. Yeah. I don't mind time yeah. trials and stuff. I think time trials are a good way of making difficulty, but fucking that's gotta yeah. be it. Yeah, this is it. Take me up to the place. Don't jump like Breath of the Wild, like jump over, just have no. to slowly climb. He just shakes his bum a bit and makes you lose stamina. I think that's like really inefficient in Breath of the Wild anyway. But I do it anyway because yeah. I'm a monk. Just take the it? time. Is that gear that increases your stamina in Breath of the Wild? Um, there's the climbing the climb. gear, yeah, it makes you climb faster. Climb. Like a lot faster. Healer. It's really irritating to get, because it's like two of the pieces in the shrine, and then the other piece is like a surrounding wandering guy selling it. The wandering guy. It's fucking... what's his name? Fucking, uh... Noblet, what's his name? Noblet, Giblet, fucking. The guy with the nose. What's the guy with the nose called in Breath of the Wild? Beetle. Like, the fuck is Noblet? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's Noblet. We got Tingle. And Gary, you fool. Yo, Christ. I got no stamina for this. Gonna run out of stamina. Cock. Did you need to have a break somewhere? I 
Do I know oh, it's what's over. Going it's oh, over. It's not over. Until Parachute. I win. Oh, I can just rest here. Okay. It's not over. Until I win. This guy is jumping up. Oh, fuck, I don't do it. <laughs> well, fuck, I played the whole game, but realizing you could jump. Pressing, the, pressing the A button. Right, if I use my parachute effectively, I can get back onto the wall here. I think I'm gonna play the new Monster Hunter when it comes out and proper get into it. Yeah, I've always wanted to really get into Monster Hunter. I play, I played Monster Hunter World a bit. Come on! Like that. I had like no hope for Rise of Ronin. I can't lie, I'm kind of all rural Japan out. You know, like we've we've had an awful lot of samurai games. We'd go to Tsushima, we had Sekiro. We've got that new one coming out where the gameplay just doesn't look possible. Yeah. That was shown at the last year's State of Play. There's a lot of they're, they're really like ever since like Ghost to Tsushima and Second was success they're really pushing on the whole rural Japan souls like genre. Yeah, this really... guy's like leaping like two meters at a time. When I jump, it does this. Do you have to hold it. Oh, oh, oh! That's how you play the game. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say. <laughs> I do remember jumping like. I that's how you is. play. The... That's how you play the game. <laughs> After free playthroughs. Damn, you put the whole the whole fucking game fighting bosses just like slowly climbing them. That's well, how you meant to do the really... bird, isn't it? No. Is that any quicker than normally climbing it though? But I went off off of it on the fucking leg, so You ain't making this it's shit. It's not nigga. over until I win. Yes it is. Over. It's over. It's over. It's not you think, over. You think they would have give you like an unlimited stamina item for being the game with all the time trials and stuff? What the fuck? No! No! How's the parachute work? It just like gives out after a second and then you can get out again. <laughs> Fortnite ass glider. Right, let me see how I've got an item that makes it. Increases damage, increases defense. Well, cock and balls. Doesn't seem like I have anything. Like that. I can make it a bit this time. Oh, I can do a start off aggro. I did not think Death Stranding 2 would be the game that was the would be the highlight of the state of play. It looks badass. It does. No, 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 no. Did he say free to play? Oh no! It's so over for Silent Hill. I thought that it would be a beginning to be the beginning. No, Silent. You don't realize how like much of an extensive fucking run Silent Hills had as a bunch of really shitty spin-offs. Oh, it's Dragon's Dogma, it's not Monster Hunter. I don't give a fuck about Dragon's Dogma. Dragon 2? It was like the game that was like competing with Dark Souls when Dark Souls first came out. Rise of the Ronin. Oh god, I, the Ronin's rising. He's not rising. So what I actually did, I've not watched the state of play, what got announced, actually anything. 
Uh, new Metro game, but it's VR, so no one gives a shit because I love when game companies waste their resources on making games that about 20 people will play. Um, that's what they do for Half Life. Uh, Rise of Ronin, which looks good. Some weeaboo shit that no one gives a fuck about. Sonic Generations Remastered, which looks peak. I mean, it's already the best Sonic game, so it doesn't matter. It's, it will be great. It's got like, it's it's a remake, but it, uh, a remaster, but it has extra levels, it's got, like a Shadow DLC. Which I'll definitely be playing full price that because I have a proper nostalgia boner for Sonic Generations because it's the only Sonic game I think I've ever played all the way through. Multiple times. I had that shit on my PS3 at my dad's and it was like the only game we had for a while because my stepmom was that strict about letting us play M rated games. Even though the PS. Oh, I uh, fucked the... this up again. Fuck! But it had this, like, this really cool like skateboarding level where you got chased by a big truck. Nice. It had like the follow me, set me free. I've replayed played that shit like a billion times. So I'll be, I'll probably be buying that fucking full price. Uh, yeah, unlike you and like a lot of other people on the internet, apparently I have a big nostalgia thing for the one of the worst, which is what Unleashed. Unleashed. <laughs> yeah, Unleashed is terrible. Generations the, has the all the level, good levels. The daytime levels are good though. Yeah, but Generations has all them levels. Cock. Set me free. Doesn't have the cool music. No, it does. That's what I'm saying. That's like all Sonic Generations is is a bunch of re like remade original levels for like the original Genesis version and the Xbox era. I thought uh, it was his own levels. Koji Kojima announced that he's making his own stealth action IP. So he's basically saying, "I'm making Metal Gear without Konami. Fuck you. I'll do it myself." Um. Silent Hill 2 trailer. Why did they just fuck him off? I don't really understand. Because he had a really bad problem for over budget in the games. He was like really expensive. That's why Metal Gear Solid 5 was cut short because the pricing of the game he was made, just so high. He made lots of money. That they, they they could yeah, but with Kojima you can't profit off his games. Oh. They're like I'd cut army like money. Like he puts that much, but like the quality of them if he just had like funding from multiple devs and stuff. Because he puts out such cutting edge. He's been doing it since the fucking dawn of time, just putting out comically. Like, Metal Gear Solid 2 is still up on par with modern day games. He's a really big. That's why Metal Gear Solid 5 was cut short, and uh, why Ground Zeroes was so short as well. He put so much money into the Ground Zeroes, which is just a teaser, and then Phantom Pain got cut halfway through. Nice. How, much stamina does, how much stamina does that jump use? It uses quite a bit, like. It seems like you. you Getting less and less higher than when you did when you were just climbing. Yeah, it does seem that way. You've got nowhere to rest up here, have you? Unless you keep on going up. Why is it up there, though? No, no you haven't. How are you about to do this? I don't fucking know, man. Have you got max stamina? I think so. The guy on YouTube said if you do it the game twice, you should have enough to get up. But it appears I definitely don't. Just have to try parachute down to that ledge beneath you. Do I have the parachute on still? That's the question. Do I normally take it off because it's really fucking annoying? <laughs> yeah, I would also show another state of play. Um. Oh, Helldivers 2, which actually looks really good. Fucking point penis. That, that, that looks unironically like, quite good. I played the first one. I played the first one a decent bit, but the first one was like a top-down, um, just like a top-down arcade shooter, and the second one's gonna be a third-person shooter. Oh, it's going too high up. Are you meant to stop here? No, there's like a little bit ahead that I was meant to stop at and didn't. Oh my god, shut the fuck, I fucking, I, ugh. I liked Spider-Man 2, but holy shit, people don't shut up about it. Sony State of Play, why didn't we get information about the Spider-Man 2 update? You think they're gonna make a trailer for New Game Plus? Or something that should have been in the, the game at launch? State of Play I've ever watched. <laughs> this game called Judas, which is coming out, which I'm not a big fan of first first person games. But this one actually looked pretty hard. It's being made by the creators of Bioshock, and it looks a lot like... Oh Bioshock. yeah, new game made by Bioshock devs. Oh. Is it interesting looking? It looks very Bioshock. Okay. 
Stranding 2, and while I'm not really, you know, excited for this game because the first game looked boring to me, I won't lie and say that the sub they showed off this game was like, it, was, it looked pretty cool. And outside of like all the You can't say this, this is the worst play state play of play I've ever seen, the and then say every game that comes up, eh, well, I don't really like this type of game, so I'm not gonna play it. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, it looks, this game looks poo poo to me. I'm never gonna try it, but it looks poo poo to me, so it's poo poo. See that guy on TikTok that sucks the dick of games he's never played? He's like, this game looks crazy, dude! <laughs> You're like, okay. The Ferrana guy. Uh, no, it's not the Ferrana guy, it's I like. fucking hate him. He's just like, uh, this black guy. I really guy. hate he just goes like, look at this, he did it for one for Shadow of the Class that came up with something, and he's like, look at the animation in this game, this is crazy, he's like, you don't know. I really hate when, when it, especially for For Honor and fighting games, that I hate, I just really dislike when people that don't play fighting games give their opinions on fighting games. There's people that actively think Xenoverse 2 is better than Dragon Ball Fighters, and that this new Budai Tenkaichi game is going to be better than Fighters. There will never be. Do, like, in the trailer, they T-pose, like, for like, four frames. Yeah. While doing the it, fights. It's, it's made on the same engine as Kakarot, which is a single player game, so I know it's going to be really dodgy that it's going to be single player mechanics in a multiplayer fighter game, so it's not going to have a high skill ceiling. Fighters isn't just a really good Dragon Ball game, it's a really good fighting game. It's like the best fighting game we've had in like 20 years because it's like a successful, well balanced tag fighter, which we haven't had since like Marvel vs. Capcom 3. Mm. It, it just works perfectly. There isn't like a single bad thing about Fighters. Maybe like, like some of the DLC characters were a bit overpowered. But, but fucking... I hate especially when people talk about Ferrana. If you haven't got like... Even my opinions are invalid on Ferrana. Because of how deep Ferrana goes mechanically. I hate when low reps or people that are just like... Rep 40 insist on th like, that thinking they're right. When they're just objectively incorrect. That's the thing problem with fighting games. Is, like It is an opinion. If a character is overkitted in Ferrana... They are objectively better. That's the that's the problem with Ferrana at the moment. Is it's not a it's not a game about skill anymore. It's whoever has the most amount of kit wins. Like when they released the Fira, the the Copy. newest like. Can this game do the thing called work? There you go. I was gonna say the climate out. of this is a I've bit boggy. Out, I've run out of stamina by the time Wanda tried to figure out where the ledge was. You fucking absolute. Yeah, they released a Fira with just every fucking thing imaginable. They're just like the most amount of kit any character has. She has a front kick, she has a back bash, she has a holding bash, she got a feint. She's got three-way mixes, she's got 50-50, she's got unblockables and dodgeables. It's just whoever has the most amount of kit wins. And especially in Dom as well, where you can throw the feats into the mix. Where she has feats that'll just guarantee you free kills. It, that's just how it is at the moment. Same with Orochi. Orochi's really overkitted at the moment. Yeah, they just what gave they him like 700 million things when they rewrote them. They give him the three-way triple bat, a uh, fucking triple, like, uh, like, rush bash, or whatever the fuck it is. They give him a bash kick, they gave him a fucking Fuck backlight, no, sidelight. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna go core core out of this, like the guy pushing the boulder up a hill. I'm gonna just record the last, like, hour and then just time off it. <laughs> I don't think I have enough stamina, I think I need to go yeah. bomb some lizards. Put it put it on 2.5 times and put some sonic music on it. Yeah. Follow me, <laughs> set me free. Horrific. You should have enough. In the original PS2 there was an exploit, I think, Someone to just like regen. Buster, holy shit. I think there was an exploit in the PS2 version where you could get your stamina back. Like, as you climbed, and that's how Mark did it at the start. I remember watching yeah. him, like, start a new game and do it. So he could go up and kill himself. Where's the one? This one. <laughs> <laughs> Actually horrendous. Do you use aggro to get a, a head start? Yeah, I guess so. That, that's, a, that's a big difference off the floor. Do you do a charge jump off aggro? Uh, you can just jump. You can stand up, but I don't think it makes a difference in how far you go. <laughs> yeah, that's a huge... Huge gap. I wouldn't use the jump unless you're on a straight line. Like yeah. now. Song is lyrics. I know, yeah. <laughs> Fuck that old shit. Stop. It 
just the, they just make depressing music like that and do, do, Spotify do, 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 told me do. that they're doing like um, a concert in Manchester soon. I was like, why would you Who's ever go going to, that? to watch? Like, <laughs> <Right? laughs> how would you even like witness it? To be fair, Mitski concerts probably the same. Yeah, people always just sing and wave their hands. You don't wave your hands for that. You see, Piccolo. Yeah, Sekiro is really a Souls, 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 Souls game. Sekiro's too high quality to be a Souls game. It's too I good. Want them to do, I want them to make good games instead of just making Souls games. I mean, Elden oh, that, I, games that's, what I, that's what I thought Elden Ring was going to be, to be honest. I thought Elden Ring was going to be something unique. Yeah, it's turned out to be Dark Souls 3. Not even, like, they didn't even have the balls to, like, make the story or the themes any different. It literally is just Dark Souls with the word Elden and fingers instead it's, of souls the, the, from what i can tell this law is slightly less depressing nah it's near fucking identical it's literally like the same shit they just they, they just got george rr martin to make the world before the collapse just but you never it's a cool see idea, the world but then he just made dark souls out of it <laughs> yeah but then you never but you never see the dark souls world before the collapse either way so okay this is a huge run this is huge, <laughs> this, is huge. this is huge this is the one I think I'm going to play the Suicide Squad game and try to enjoy it just so I can argue with people on the internet that it's actually decent. Just because I, I like hate having, I like playing Devil's Advocate for games sometimes. I uh, know, and I just really don't like the Arkham games. So I like feel my like hatred my for New Vegas. Realistically, New Vegas isn't a bad game, but I just say it is. Uh, nah, New Vegas is a bad... No, New Vegas, New Vegas is... Nah, nah, nah. New Vegas is a good, like, Monkey Island story game, but it is a shit fucking action shooter. Like actual games, yeah. That's why yeah, I it, it, New Vegas is a good game, but it isn't fun. I can't cave like I can't cave people's heads in with a sledgehammer like, like Fallout 4. I have to like go like into vats. Wanda, you're being a dick. Get over there. This is huge. This is the run. This is, this the, is the run. run. <laughs> this is the run. <laughs> Shit, this is it. It's not over until I win. See, do you not like lose less stamina if you have your sword away? I was literally you... just thinking that. What? Put that away. Put that away. You're, you're wasting stamina. You're wasting stamina. <laughs> Fucking Zoro. His triple swords. All fitting in the same scabbard. Did you like a back leap here? Yeah. Right. Huge. Do I go up or down? Do I go up or down? Huge. <laughs> I talk to my friends in the Justice League. This is so funny. That's like more comic accurate than any of the Arkham games. Batman has like no human moments in the Arkham games. He's just a fucking unstoppable force. God, the, the, Jujutsu, the Jujutsu Kaisen game looks fucking awful. Oh, yeah, Have you seen how bad that looks? <laughs> People have memed I'm the just Dragon Ball game. I'm the Dragon Ball game's gonna save. Games come back to Fortnite for it. That's all I'm hoping. People are really praying that this new Dragon Ball game is going to save anime fighters because anime fighters at the moment are fucking dread. They're all the same. They're all just clones of the, the Naruto Ninja Storm games. You're just like in an arena, like a 3D arena, throwing auto combos. Please save us. Dragon Ball, please save us. This is the one. You've made it. I think. I need a place to rest. Why are you the top. Keep, keep, keep going up. No. What are you doing? <laughs> it's not over. It's not over. Can you rest there? Nah, it's over, bro. The Mitsuki's cable from my 4 you page. Fuck. <laughs> no. It's over. It's over. Well, nah, yeah, I'm finished. If I can get to that ledge, I might be able to rest there. I don't think so, that is not enough room. Parachute! Go up and- No! Jump up and parachute! No, I went what? through it! What? What? <laughs> Fucking hell. He just died! <laughs> oh, no, I'm Dude. finished. Right, I think I need to go kill some more lizards. I think that's just the way I'm gathering from this. Fucking miserable. Fucking 
fucking hell, man. I can go. What the 